Consistency is key for achieving any major goal. I think everyone's aware of this, or at least I hope this is not something you've heard once just coming from me the first time. I've said it before on the channel for starters. Consistency and like never quitting almost makes it impossible to fail. Like, because you'll have some degree of success in no matter what you do. My favorite example of this is, is like, is Andy at Kill You're In A Loser recently. His channel is really starting to pick up subscribers. He's paying off all of his financial goals this year. And when you look at the time scale, like his blog, I believe he started writing his blog in either late 2018 or 2019. So he had like, and, I, and everyone knows this, if you start a blog or a YouTube channel or anything like that, you're looking at a minimum like two year runway before you really pick up any steam. Now, I manage a channel for a company and they have managed a quicker runway to a decent sized channel. But the reason they have is that they are an established company that's been running for 30 odd years. They have a lot of social media with high numbers, like their Instagram's got like 10,000 followers. Their Facebook has like 7,000 followers. It was easy for me to take control of their other social media and spread the YouTube content around and get more subscribers. That's a different case. But for guys who are starting from the ground up, it's gonna take a long time and consistent content production for you to get anywhere. And Andy's proven this in like, in like two years, he's picked himself up to a point where he can pay all his bills and he's starting to hit higher financial goals than he had. And even me, I'm starting to recognize that I didn't have much expectation for this channel. I didn't have much expectation for me giving self-improvement advice. Like I don't consider myself advanced or an expert. I consider myself somewhere in the middle. Like I'm not in my newbie stage anymore but I'm not like Andy's level. I'm not where Chris from Good Looking Loser was. I'm, I don't consider myself at the level of a lot of content creators, but I've been chugging along and I'm somehow picked up a small audience of like, I don't know, at least some of my videos get to like 20 views without really being a good video. And it's just, some people are watching my videos now. Like back in the day, I would get like fuck all views. Like videos would get like four views, you know? Like that would be, two of them would be me. Like, but now for some reason I get comments, like Andy reposts my shit. Uh, which obviously really helps. Thank you, Andy. And yeah, it's just been consistency. Like I am 281 days into my 365 project. I have about 80 more days to go before the year is up. And I'm, I probably, I'd imagine I'll probably hit 100 subscribers before this project ends or as this project ends, which is mad. Like I didn't think anyone would want to watch this channel. Like I listened to tons of people talking about how their channels were dead for like three, four years, like long, long runways to get to anything decent. So yeah, it's a bit, it's a bit mental, uh, especially as I don't do like cool thumbnails or eye catching titles. And I'm very grateful for this, like just, even though these numbers are nothing like that impressive, I'm still grateful, you know, like I'm still grateful that anyone watches this content or talks about it. But consistency in other areas, like in all of your endeavors, gym, girls, dating, every single area is consistency, daily effort, building on what you've done before, doing better work than previously. It's all about consistency. It's all about not giving up. And I knew this when I started, but it's not until you see the results coming in that you like, it reaffirms what you already believed and you already knew. So yeah, stay consistent. Don't jump between goals every second week. I know I talked about previously that I, I'm switching the priority of my goals. It doesn't mean I'm canning goals. Like, I have two big goals and I'm consistently applying myself towards both of them. I'm just switching my priority a little bit. So like content creation is now my priority. My website is now my priority, but I'm still dating. Like, I'm still having that goal. It's just a background goal. Consistency with all your goals, regardless of how you prioritize them. All right, guys, I'll see you again tomorrow. Peace out.